two years ago, I produced a video called A Mallet for Vlad. And that was the inception of what is now called the Katz Moses Woodworkers with Disabilities Fund. This is a charity that aims to get resources in the hands of people that need it most. You know, you and I can both attest to the fact that building something is one of the most cathartic exercises out there. It is proven to help people with disabilities, injuries, both mental and physical, decrease their recovery time, as well as give them the self-confidence to to go out and attack life. Building things is wonderful, is my point. And we all know that. Two years ago, when we started this charity, we didn't know what it would become. But I'm really excited to announce today uh, that it has grown into something amazing. We just hired a full-time director, Chris Giffro from Cowdog Craftworks, which will be linked down below. He is also putting out a video today about these builds that we're gonna talk about here in a minute. We have a full board. So we've got board members now, including Kristen from Total Boat, who Total Boat's been a fantastic supporter of this industry. They are fantastic, uh, as well as a couple other people that are really knowledgeable about all things disabilities. Uh, one of them is the gentleman who manufactures my dovetail jig, Bill Spraker from Spraker Engineering. He's got like 25 patents on prosthetics and really understands what is needed for people with disabilities. A good friend of mine, Phil Plant, uh, who is phenomenal at raising money and knows a lot about how to run an organization like this. Just recently, we raised $40,000 to get over 30 families out of the Ukraine that were living on Vlad's Ranch, the original recipient from this charity. And we're doing a lot of things, but we have come up with a way to do a lot more. And we really need your help. So we are going to announce today the Build Up Initiative. This is an initiative that is aims to connect thousands of people who need help with those who wanna help. And we have a lot of ways that you can help us do that. First and foremost, we need donations. We are raising money for electric winches for our gantry crane build, which we're gonna talk about a little bit more here in a second. And then we need help. So we have created a semi-autonomous application system on our website that allows people who want to help to apply, people who need help to apply. It allows us to process a lot more applications than we would if we were you know, up taking applicants one at a time via email. Um, so if you wanna help out, there's gonna be some links down below. We can connect you with people in your area, whether you wanna build one of these projects or you just wanna go over there for an hour and help them unload some wood out of the truck or put together a tool, we're gonna be able to connect people and it's so cool. And we spent over a year building this. What this Build Up Initiative is, is we've created a series of three projects that not only are great projects to have in your shop, this is a gantry crane, this one-handed mini workbench that you see here, as well as a low combination workhorse that Chris Giffro is building over on his channel. We've created these three projects that would greatly help people with disabilities, varying work holding needs, as well as some other things. So you can buy one of these three sets of plans or over on the website, the proceeds all go to benefit the charity. And then once you build them and we connect you with somebody to donate them to, now what, we're aim what our aim is, is to find people in your area that you can donate these to so you don't have to like try and mail a gantry crane, like that would be nearly impossible. We are going to connect you with these people so you can bring it over to them, you can get the joy of donating, and then we're gonna give you a tax deductible receipt for your the fair market value of it. I'm not talking about just reimbursing you for materials. I think we value your labor there at $75 an hour. So it would be like what you could sell this at your you know top, top price. That will be the tax deductible receipt we provide when we hook you up with a recipient. And if you can't do any of those things, if you can't donate money, if you can't donate your time and build something, uh, spread the word. You can share this video. You can share Chris's video. Uh, go subscribe to Chris's channel. He's so awesome. He's a great builder. He does a lot of Japanese hand tools. Really cool guy. Uh, and he's done fantastic things for this charity. So uh, those are the three ways you can help us. Donate money, uh, donate your time, build something uh, from our plans and donate it. And we'll set you up with somebody who needs it or just spread the word. We really appreciate that. So let's talk about these projects. Now, I have to stress, these projects are not just for people with physical limitations. Like these are freaking awesome things. Like we've already used the gantry crane. We're moving shops. You can see there's nothing behind me. And then, you know, you don't have to put up the money for that electric hoist. We will pay for it. And that's why we're raising money. But this gantry crane is phenomenal. Now we've had an engineer check this out. So we have stamped plans on these. Uh, an engineer has given it the go ahead for 500 pounds. Uh, you can make this gantry crane smaller. You can take the plans and make it shorter so it'll fit into your garage. You can make it narrower. You just can't make it bigger, obviously, because we have not had the engineering clearance for that, but smaller is fine. It's a fantastic tool. One of the things we hear from people in wheelchairs, the hardest part about woodworking is that they can't flip things over and they can't get things out of their truck. 
So this gantry crane is a fantastic way to do that. And like I said, you know, we will provide the lift when you donate it. So we'll send it to the recipient's house, the electric hoist. So all you gotta do is show up with that gantry crane. The way that it's built, you could even assemble uh, the gantry and the posts when you get there. It's a really, really neat project. It's all out of construction lumber, super cool. The low combination workhorse that Chris Giffro is working on, he'll have a step-by-step -step build video on his channel, link down below, is super cool because it's low to the ground, so it's great if you're in a wheelchair. It's also great if you have limited grip strength because you can, you know, if you only have one hand, you can put your knee on a piece of wood and there's lots of different ways to use it. It has hold fast, uh, it has dog holes, so you can, you know, hold things down, you can clamp stuff to it. It's a phenomenal piece of, kit for anybody, especially those who have limited, you know, grip strength or the ability to get up and up to a higher workbench. So it's really cool. Lastly, uh, one of my favorites because it looks a lot like our Moxon vice and then it was, you know, just fun to build. It's built out of walnut and maple. So it's super cool. Uh, is the one handed micro workbench here. Like I said, we have step by step plans for all of these things and this one was a lot of fun and there's templates available for this one which has the vice that i used here you could obviously upgrade the vice this is kind of a more inexpensive one um, but i have a whole template for it that's really easy to to use you just set it down it's got a centering line you just set it down the distance of your tabletop that's where the vice goes because it screws to the bottom so that's where it goes but this is really cool because you can operate it with one hand which is a big deal for people with disabilities, I mean, it's also just such a cool bench, but you can use one hand to do it. It's got dog holes for hold fast, and it's beautiful. It's very much like my Moxon Vice, uh, probably less expensive to build than my Moxon Vice. And as you guys know, I've used that Moxon Vice in every video I've ever produced for the last five years. So it's fantastic and is so useful. To sum all this up, this is the Build Up Initiative. Donate buy plans, you can build them and donate them or just buying plans is gonna help the charity too. If you wanna build these yourself, you don't have to donate them to the charity. Buying them, the proceeds will go to the charity. And if you wanna nominate somebody, if you know somebody that you think would be a good recipient for this charity, let them know. You can send them over to the application you can email Chris Giffro. His email will be down below, he's our director and we'll get help in the hands of people who need it. And that is our goal here is use our vast reach in this industry, our influence with companies who want to donate things to our charity so they get mentioned in videos because we don't take sponsorships. We can use that. We can use that to help people. And I think we can use that to help thousands of people. So if you want to help us, there's a lot of ways down in that pinned comment and description to do that. Guys, thank you so much. Uh, I, we're moving shops right now. Your support has been fantastic and amazing. And this charity is something that's so near and dear to my heart. My whole life has always said, do well by doing good. And it would be silly that we found all this success in this industry and we didn't use that to help others. So help me help people and thank you so much for your support. Guys, as always, stay safe in the shop. Everything will be down in that pinned comment description. Thanks for watching, have a wonderful day.